Welcome to Play This Collectibles from Whittier, California. Today is Taco Tuesday again. And yes, I'm very hungry for tacos. And today is 12, 13. It's one of those days. Just kidding, it's the 13. Uh, so November 13, 2018. Welcome back again. And today, I'm just going to show you guys what I found during the week, okay? So let's see what goodies I found. I found this cool racing hitch and toe from Green Light at Hobby Lobby. They're very expensive there, so you guys already know that. There's a couple of Hobby Lobbies, you know, throughout the city. One in West Covina, and one in La Habra, I believe. And one in, uh, I think is by the 91 and 605 by South Street exit. So there it is, pretty cool. This one says, uh, wow, can't even read it. Too small. But it looks cool. I got it because it looks like Moon Eyes colors. So if you guys like this, go to Hobby Lobby. Let's see what else is in here. I found these at Big Lots, and they're a dollar plus tax, including this. And uh, they have my receipt right here big lots and I travel all over the place so I drive all over the place just to find stuff this was found in Highland city of Highland in San Bernardino and uh, you know it's worth a try going to so many stores see if you find a super but that's what I found might as well buy something since I'm there and I could always uh, repaint these trucks customize them make them look better and let's see what else is in my box got this at a Walmart on the way back from Highland and uh, this is the only thing that was hanging so I like this car pretty cool Moon Eyes you know it's popular right now so uh, I get them as many as I can get because I know later on they're not gonna be around for the licensing so get them while they're hot we got this right here 50 favorites of course you guys already have this had opened a couple of boxes before but it's a bus you know you can't leave it behind it's very heavy pretty cool so this is another addition to the store i'm pretty sure you guys have found those are fruit for less and ralph so what else do i have here oh wow that's pretty cool flow tech exhaust m2 auto drivers this is 1969 dodge charger daytona with the hemi cool colors black with the front is white with flames pretty cool I like this kind of casting because it's pretty detailed. And of course, you know, it's almost like a match. Right there looks pretty cool. So if you open all these up, put them all on display, you're gonna have an awesome display. And of course, who doesn't have this? 1955 Gasser from the 50 Favorites. And of course, everybody's dream is to find the black one with the white roof or the green one with the white roof. And that's the chase piece. They are coming out of Walmart, KC. So if you guys remember, you can find a KC with the, the code. They have two black ones in there and a pink one. So this is nice to have and keep for five years. That's one's going to be maybe pretty hot. <laughs> but right now, Everybody has tons of these in their boxes, home, their cars. And uh, we have so many right here in LA County that I go to the stores and I still see them there hanging. But, uh, you know, it doesn't hurt to buy more. Then, I got the Maisto design. I like this cool rant truck with a 1957 Chevy Gasser. Bell or Gasser, actually. Uh, I got this because it looks pretty awesome. I'm going to switch the tires on this gasser and maybe dip, put like some Hot Wheel uh, slicks on it and make it look better. But I do like the color scheme. Pretty cool. So if I was you guys, uh, buy some of these for the, your dioramas. It looks pretty awesome. Let me see what else do I find in here. Another Maisto de uh, design. It's, uh, they call the Mistletoe Flatbed. 
1987 Buick Regal. Pretty awesome. Cool color. Purple. I also got it because the Regal is pretty hot right now too. You can make that into a lowrider. Repaint it and put some wire wheels. What else do I have in here? Oh, another uh, ramp truck. As you can tell, you know, I do like this truck a lot because I can use other Hot Wheels on it. Let's make it for my diorama. What else do I find in here? Oh, another uh, Maisto design. International Durastar flatbed with a 1959 Chevy Impala. Oh, what is this piece of paper? Thought it was a worm. Anyways, I like the flatbed truck too. It's pretty cool. Could also use it with another car, repaint it, and make it look more, more better. So there you have it. Oh, another another one here. Let's see. Oh, it's just another Buick Regal. I mean, uh, oh yeah, it's a Regal. So there you have it, everybody. This is my weekly finds. I keep going to the stores every day. Trust me, when I come to my store, I stop at Target, and sometimes at Target I haven't gotten uh, lucky, so I haven't found anything. But at Walmart, sometimes you'll find some stuff hiding, so always look around wherever the toy section's at, bottom, top, move boxes, because somehow the employees hide stuff for other people, or maybe for, for you, <laughs> or for me, but is worth it okay look around you never know it could be in the top bottom i always go around the toy section once twice and i go further one more aisle down and then one more aisle down upper and just to make sure you never know i have found some good stuff so i suggest you guys do the same thing so good luck in your hunting and go eat your tacos right now since it's pretty early and who knows you might find a lunch truck that has two for one because i i do have one here down the street where I, I mean, where my shop's at, Whittier and Hatley, there's a truck right there that has two tacos for a dollar, which is a great deal. And that's why I'm getting a belly. There's too many tacos. Anyways, hopefully you guys will enjoy your evening. And thank you for turning into my channel. And let's have fun. Let's collect. And be friendly to each other. And uh, remember, 500 subscribers give five things away. So refer me to your friends and family, coworkers, neighbors, people you don't like. And tell them to subscribe, okay? So, adios!